In the past, people have been getting bizarre in the bedroom and things have gone much dirty and disgusting. No matter it was because of any lifestyle, customs or tradition, following the culture was only the thing they could do whether they liked it or not. From sleeping with a girl of six years to sharing a common wife for brothers in a family. So today, I'm going to tell you about weird and crazy sexual rituals around the world. 1. In Indonesia people can have sex outside marriage during Pan celebration. According to a myth in Indonesia people believe that the, the couples have to spend the night with someone except then their husband or wife and must have sexual intercourse between them. It is also said that if they get intimate with the same partners for all the seven celebrations they did earlier, it would bring them good luck and wishes. 2. Public Masturbation Ceremonies in Ancient Egypt Ancient Egypt was obsessed with jerking off. It was believed by the people that the ebb and flow of the Nile was originated by their god of creation's ejaculation. Therefore, the men of Egypt would spiritually masturbate into the Nile to assure an ample amount of water for their crops. 3. Boys and girls of Sambian tribe are supposed to drink semen. The Sambian tribe of New Guinea have an oral history of dissociating their boys from the girls at very early stage from 7 to 10 years. The children of the tribe had to go through extreme conditions which included piercings, bleeding of nose and drinking semen of the tribe's mightiest warriors sessions. 4. In Mangaya, old women sleep with young boys. An island in the South Pacific Ocean known as Mangaya, is famous because of its strange sexual tradition. The young boy children of 13 years are supposed to have sex with women older to their age and they teach them the tricks to please their partners. 5. Some Nepali tribes in the Himalayas where brothers share a wife. We all must heard about a man having more than one wives but ever thought of having more than one husband for a wife. Not really, but this is actually a reality of a tribe residing in the Himalayas region. Brothers in a family share a common women for their complete married life. Polyandry is not only practiced in this region but is also accepted as a part of tradition and culture. 6. Girls of Trobriander tribe gets into sexual acts from age of 6. In the Trobriander tribe from Papua, New Guinea is justified and legal to have a sexual intercourse with a girl of age 6. It's completely disgusting and disturbing to come over through the fact that a girl whose age is to play with the toys is being someone's toy of pleasure. Must say rest in peace humanity. Whereas even the boys get into sexual activity from the age 10 to 12. Is it actually justified? 7. Women feed armpit flavored apples to their partner in rural Austria. In rural Austria, young ladies perform a traditional dance with slices of apple stuffed in their armpits. After dancing women go to their their man of their interest and offers them a slice which is then eaten by the man. It indicates that the man would always love having sexual pleasure no matter from which body part it is. 8. In Haiti sex is a part of religious rite. In Haiti getting physical is a part of religious beliefs. People believe that having sex makes the goddess of love happy and showers their married life with peace and love. Apart from this, strange black magic practices are too performed as a spiritual belief. All men and women takes naked bath together under the waterfall which also includes sexual dance. 9. Wife Stealing Festival in Wadabi Tribe In the Wadabi Tribe of Niger in West Africa, men try to win over wives of other men. This happens during the yearly Garawal Festival, when men of Wadabi Tribe try to impress women. If a woman gets impressed and agrees to live with the man she can marry him and stays for one year until the festival comes. Their relationship is considered legal, and if a married woman gets impressed with another man, she is free to go with him and her husband cannot stop her. 10. Pay for a temporary marriage in Iran. While Muslim practices some of the strict laws regarding sexual intercourse and relationships between men and women. However, in Iran, a young couple can request a temporary marriage. They can pay for a short ceremony which includes a written contract that states the time for which they will be married. Once done they can live like husband-wife and can judge each other. So the world and people are amazing. Their traditions and cultures are very different. We don't even think about such things, but they are normal to them. So what do you think about these things? 